Hello and a very welcome back to Sign Away Studios. We are your hosts, Kelly and Sarah. Hello, 欢迎大家来到我们的 Sign Away 演播厅。她是 Sarah， 我是 Kelly. And today we are at the incredible White Water Brewery, which is a multi-award-winning craft microbrewery in County Down, Ireland. 那我们今天呢，来到了特别令人惊艳的这个 White Water 酿酒厂。它是位于爱尔兰的这个当镇。This is a very exciting month for the White Water Brewery because not only have they celebrated their silver 25th anniversary, but they were also recognised at the prestigious international wine and spirits competition. 那这个月份呢，对于 White Water 酿酒厂来说呢，是特别忙碌的一个月，因为他们在忙于庆祝他们的银色纪念日，就是这个酿酒厂现在已经是二十五岁了。并且呢，它值得另外一个纪念的事情呢，是它是被国际烈酒挑战赛认可了。So will we go have a look inside? Why not? 那我们现在就要进去看一下了。So we are joined by the legend and founder of the White Water Brewery, Mr. Bernard Sloan. 我们今天有幸邀请到了他的创始人，这是一位传奇人物，他的名字是 Bernard Sloan 先生。So Bernard, thank you so much for having us in today. This is a very exciting time for the company. A huge congratulations on celebrating your 25th silver anniversary. Have you any thoughts or reflections on this? Yes, lots.、Uh, first of all, very very welcome to Whitewater.、Uh, we're in our new facility, which is、uh, which we're announced is 2017. But thinking back to when we started on the small family farm in 1996,、uh, we just look at the journey that we've that we've encountered and all.、Uh, Trials and tribulations, but yeah, very proud of where we are now.、Mm -hmm. Very proud. Very good. And what was your family's reaction when you said you're going to open up a microbrewery on the farm? We're from a fifth generation farm, and we grew a lot of potatoes. And when I said I I didn't want to be a farmer, but I wanted to be a brewer, and when I told my father I was starting a brewery, a microbrewery, he did not know what it was. So it was pretty much、uh, there's a barn, you can use that barn. So he had confidence in me. Mm -hmm. uh, but yes, it was a bit of a what is a brewery, <laughs> a microbrewery. <laughs> <laughs> so, Bernard, can you tell us just a bit of background on your journey into craft and microbrewing? Bernard, 你能给我们大概说一下你的做这个精酿啤酒的这个心路历程吗 ？My journey into brewing was because I like beer and like making different styles of beers, even from a very very early age. So, getting into something which is a, a passion of mine、uh, is something to enjoy because you're you're doing what you like to do. And making nice beers. It's passionate about it. Very much. <laughs> As a craft microbrewery, how do you stay competitive with bigger players in the market? As a craft microbrewery, how do you stay competitive with bigger players in the market? Well, we never try and compete on price because we're always using the best ingredients that that are available, and I think it's the quality that makes the makes the difference. Because if you try and make things at a very very low price, then You're going for the mass-produced audience, so we want to make something which is competitively priced, but has fantastic flavours, and that makes gives us the little edge on the big breweries. So, Brian, can we go have a look inside the brewery? We can. 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 Well, what we have here is we have the, the filling operation, where we're filling around about three thousand cans an hour on our thirty-three, three hundred thirty mil can line. What you see here is、uh, we're filling the cans. We have the beer at around about zero degrees, nearly very, very, very cold. Coming into the cans, we're filling six at a time, and then we're seaming them very, very quickly, putting a lid on them. The beer slowly moves through the machine, gets heat treated. And then it's sterile. After it gets heat treated, we put it through our labeling machine, where it's labeled, and then it's packed onto a case. So we're kind of filling, heat treating, and labeling. So that's our batch code and on、uh, the best before date. Bernard, this is. Fantastic scale of an operation. Would you mind running us through the production process that happens here? Uh, Bernard, can you help us? You can help us to show us the process of the production process. In here, we take our lovely malted barley, our Irish malted barley, and we take hops from all over the world. 
together to make our beer. So what we do is we take our grain and we crush it, we add water to it, and then we slowly ferment it for maybe seven to 10 days. And then we add hops to this and we let it stay in our brewery at very, very cold for approximately one month. A lot of people's ears perk up when they hear about hoppy beers, but a lot of people don't actually understand exactly what a hop is. So would you mind explaining what a hop is and the impact it has on the character of a beer? Hops are particularly flowers, which grow in warmer countries. In Ireland, we don't get a lot of hops, no. but they have a fantastic smell to the beer, they have a fantastic aroma to the beer, and when they're boiled with the, with the sweet liquid, they produce bitterness. So we use hops from all over the world, from Australia, America, from Germany, from England. And when we put them all together, it creates a, a specific infused flavor, very, very unique to that beer. Some of our beers maybe have five hops, six hops, different, different, different varieties from all over the world. So throughout your portfolio, you some very interesting and cool brand names. So what was your inspiration behind the branding? You made the name of these brands some of our original beers were made from the yeast from the Belfast Brewery. So we had our Belfast Lager, our Belfast Ale. But some of them we, we, we started on a farm. So one of our beers is called You Rebel, which is a name for a sheep. Uh, and another one is called Maggie's Leap, which is a, a landmark in our area. So local names. Brennan, well, thank you so much for having us in today and showing us around the brewery. It's very interesting to learn more about craft and life you're brewing as well. And I look forward to sampling some of the beers. But at that we can see uh you can also go to the channel. Now we can see the more about the beer. We can look at some of the beer. Yes, it's a very, very warm day in Whitewater, so let's enjoy a cold beer. <laughs>